And, and then the Patriots win the Super Bowl 28-24 to over Pete Carroll and the defending Super Bowl champion Seahawks. Uh, of course, that Super Bowl is known for the Malcolm Butler play, greatest play in Super Bowl history. Pete Carroll is known for making the worst call in Super Bowl history, and Russell Wilson makes the worst throw in Super Bowl history. Uh, they had beast mode, Marshawn Lynch, uh, who had a TD earlier in the game, and he had a big catch down the sideline in that final drive. But the word was Pete Carroll didn't want Marshawn Lynch, beast mode, to be MVP, so that's why they sent in that play for Russell Wilson to throw it on second down at the one, ridiculous. And even before that, on first down, Marshawn Lynch went from the five to the one. Uh, and it was a great tackle by Hightower, saving him from going into the end zone. But Pete Carroll gets all the heat for that bad call, and it seems like Russell Wilson gets off the hook. When that call came in, Russell Wilson was the Super Bowl winning quarterback from the previous year, so he had cachet. He could have said to his players, we're not running this. I'm, I'm, I'll do a quarterback sneak, uh, it, it kind of burrow in, and, and then it'll be third down. And uh, uh, nope, and they didn't want to give it to beast mode. Instead, on second down, they hike it in the shotgun, going the other way. So just ridiculous call. Uh, Patriots, Tom Brady, we remember he was jumping on the sideline when, uh, when Malcolm Butler made the greatest play in Super Bowl history. And uh, to Pats fans, that's our good buddy, our good old buddy Pete Carroll, who was the coach of the Patriots for three years, didn't do that good of a job after Bill Parcells left him a, a great, great team. When Bill Parcell stepped down after going to the Super Bowl, Pete Carroll was our coach for three years. They went to the playoffs twice, never even close to uh, uh, realizing their potential. But Pete Carroll just, uh, he still must stare at the ceiling at night after that call. Because they were, you know, you're at the one yard line, you, you know, if you're betting in Las Vegas, you, you're kind of saying uh, you, your odds are good that you're going to win that ball game. They would have won back-to-back -back against Peyton Manning and against Brady. But, nope, they want to throw it on second second down. And when uh, when I see a Seahawks fan, if I got my Patriots hat on, for the first thing they look up, like, oh, boy. And, and so Seahawks fans are still, and they'll never get over that, uh, you know, that just the worst call and the worst throw in Super Bowl history by the Seahawks. But uh, Tom Brady... He got to uh, uh, four championships on that day, and he's now Brady had a four and two Super Bowl record, and uh, uh, but what a game against the Seahawks! Some people.